G'day. Hotel spas get a do-over every day. G'day, g'day, g'day. It always amazes me how in a hotel spa environment, we don't really take advantage of the fact that every day we get a do-over because every day we have new guests coming through the door of the hotel at least. And there are some exceptions to that, of course, with some remote resort locations where maybe there's only two arrival flights per week. But for the most part, most hotel spas have new guests coming into the hotel every day. And what that does is give us an opportunity to try something new every day because there's new people to try it with. Or we can try the same old thing that we tried yesterday, but now we've got a fresh set of audience, a fresh set of eyes and ears to maybe see what their reaction is. And more to the point, what that does, the understanding that we get a do-over every day, what that really does is give you cover, gives you comfort in trying something new that doesn't work today. So if you try something new and it doesn't work, it doesn't matter. The people that didn't like it yesterday, they'll be gone in a couple of days. You've got new people tomorrow. And it's something that came out during a conversation I had with some of our spa managers here in Malaysia this week when we started talking about the price point and we looked at what our break-even cost was because I wanted them to understand that if we sell a treatment for any amount over the break-even cost, we're actually making money. And so if you wanted to do something really crazy, let's just drop the the price to maybe break-even plus an extra 10 or 20 bucks and let's see what happens. And if it doesn't work, no problem. If we don't get enough of a lift to justify the drop in the price, then we can stop it. We can just do a special one day promotion. Do it on the back of a big event like Global Wellness Day or Global Bathing Day or or any other type of occasion. Just make it a very, very strict, limited offer. Try it. Does it get you the bump or not? Because the reason that I get when I talk to a lot of spa managers about why their business isn't really working as well as it should, they tell me the guests are always complaining about the price. Well, if that's true, let's drop the price. Let's find out what the minimum price that we can possibly make, make a living on and let's put it down to that price just for a short period, see if it works. And if it doesn't work, guess what? We get a do-over tomorrow. So I think it's quite liberating to think about the fact that in a hotel spa, you get a do-over every day. Now, there's not a lot of businesses that necessarily have that sort of opportunity like we do. So if you've got a do-over every day, then what are you going to do tomorrow? Alrighty, that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in. I will be back again tomorrow. See ya. Well,